Hey there everybody, Arlo's here from Ice Games, bringing you episode 7 of my Guild Wars 2 Char Let's Play. So we are still in the Ashen, the, uh, the, uh, the Plains of Ashford, or the Ashen Ford, I don't know, the Plains of Ashford. So we are, looks like we're just about ready to wrap up here. Uh, we got one more waypoint, one more point of interest, one more task, one more vista, and uh, all the hero challenges. We are just about to finish up with this area, so I'm pretty excited for this. So let's uh, let's just head out there. I also realized I'm level 18 already. I, that's crazy. I didn't realize I was getting that high level, and then I went back and checked my videos. And yeah, yeah, it's be mainly because I <laughs> I had to like go back in one area. But yeah, I'm level level 16 now, which is pretty, or level 18 now, which is pretty awesome. Whoop! I recover stolen containers from harpies. So you get a little uh, whoop. Jump down a hill. We got a little mission to do here. We also have the... Oh, the Vista's up here. The heart is down here. So let's talk to uh, Sagum Relic Seeker. Uh, so... Is the greatest treasure. Oh, welcome. We've a need of explorers like yourself. There is much to discover, and we could use your protection. Uh, what are you looking into here? Uh, researching an old Ascalonian city, of course. We're searching for artifacts, but it's dangerous work. Uh, what's dangerous around here? Why? What isn't dangerous here? The harpies infest the ruins of the wall. Uh, the harpies infesting the ruins of the walls won't give us a moment's peace. They keep attacking us. Uh, so make sure we gotta we gotta help them out. Uh, I think I have some of these thingies. There we go. So let's go. Ooh, that's kind of cool. I'm not sure what that is. So let's uh, take out some harpies along the wall. Kill harpies along the wall and help the Roman Priory recover artifacts. And apparently check out my dailies. I want to I want to check this out first, actually. This looks really cool. Um, oh, it's actually a hidden area, too. Uh, what is down there? Some creatures. Earth elementals down there. That is cool. They have stability. Angris Gorge something or other. Is there a point of interest down here? There is a point of interest down here, too. Awesome. Ooh, let's take out some earth elementals. Hua! Oh man, oh, it looks like they made like a wall there. I gotta make sure I'm not in the way of. Oh, it's dropping me down to level 16 here, though. Oh man. <laughs> I missed. Apparently, I missed. Smash him down. Oh. I'm gonna use my. Hammers here, though. Light the light the earth elemental on fire. Not quite sure how that works, but okay, I'll take it. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Let's interact. Oh, I got to turn off my hammers. There's a little plaque here. It looks like. So let's see what it says. So the weathered plaque appears to describe the crystal in front of you. Examine the crystal remnant. Uh, from the searing, the ruthless Char used their magic to destroy much of the human civilization. Continue. Their efforts were rebuffed by the people of Ascalon. King uh, Adel Adelburn remains in power, and the Char will soon be driven back. Um, unfortunately, that did not happen. As you can see, the Char are in power. That, that is kind of cool. I like that. You know, little things like that that make the game so much, so much better. So much more uh, lived in. So much more like things are going on here. I like it. Let's close that. All right. How do I get up there? there there's a th that event nearby. Let's see if we can uh, take out some harpies and grab some items to help out. Young harpies. Let's take out these young harpies. Wah! Switched on my hammer, maybe. Have some fun with this. Smack. <laughs> yeah, come chase, chase after me over there, harpy. Didn't help you, did it? <laughs> Ooh, a harpy warrior. Ooh, you got some pretty nice equipment there. I like that. Smash. There we go. Come on. There we go. Oh, I think those... Oh, someone else has popped up. Magically popped up there right in front of me. Let's light this one on fire. do 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 So things are going really, really well for my char here. I'm really liking it a lot. Ooh, that's a cool mask you got in there, buddy. I like that. Um, clearly extra awesome level there. You're pretty high level there. Um, I'm going to head around here first to drop off my items for this uh, quest. Just so I make sure I get in on it. 
because I would like that. Oh, here you are. That's uh, I have some right here. Thank you for your help. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad I could help. Uh, looks like I probably have this. Looks like there's a path here to walk just up along here. So, and by walk along, I mean still jump along. Whoop! We got a little uh, gonna jump here. Jump, jump, jump. We made it. All right, guys. First try. I like what happens. All right, let's head up here. Looks like a lot of the char ones are up on these little uh, plateaus here. So let's uh, take a quick look at this vista and see. Uh, see if I probably show you the crystal down there. I'm guessing. Yeah, that's what I thought. As soon as I saw the crystal, when you can see the vista, it's going to show us this, this awesome little crystal here. So apparently, this has something to do with the first game. Not sure exactly what, but. Uh, I don't know. It looks kind of cool. The Char used their mystical powers probably to break through the wall and whatnot. I like that. Alright. So, ooh. We got a daily progress reward, too. What do we get for this? We're going to get... Uh, oh, this, this is the one we always get. I always get the Vista one because I spend a lot of time getting Vistas. Oh, let's put that down here. Wait, do I not have... I have the wrong mace equipped. There we go. <laughs> Can't have that crappy mace equipped. I gotta have my nice mace equipped. All right, let's get some karma. Here, a trophy. I can I get rid of this one? No, I can't. I'm just gonna get rid of it that way. Get rid of it that way. There we go. Eh, jump down. Bloop. All right. Where are we headed to next? Oh, I still gotta take out some harpies around here. Where are some harpies? Oh, got some harpies over here. See if we can help out before they're all dead. <laughs> there we go. Grab some more. Ooh, thanks. Making me go faster. I like that. Is that what, like, your, one of your abilities, I'm guessing? Is that Guardian? That'd be kind of cool. I like that. Oh, do, 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 do. do you have a question? Uh, some right here. Looks like we got all that we need to here. Oh, we got silver in this one. Got to get some more harpies here. All right, all right, all right. Oh, I do have to repair some stuff here. Apparently, what's, what needs to be repaired? Oh, oh, my backpack and stuff can get damaged too? I didn't know that. That's actually cool. I like that. I mean, I don't like that. I mean... I don't like the fact that it didn't get damaged, but it's better that than, like, my sword or something like that. Although, you guys were letting me know that uh, as this breaks down, like, I could eventually be, uh, I think, 7-9 uh, uh, or Sabrina, you were mentioning how uh, if I if I lose, if it gets too broken down, like, um, green is fine, yellow or orange means that it's kind of, like, not working to 100%, and then I believe it can, you can break further than that, and then it kind of, like, disappears off me, but I can still repair it after. But, like, apparently if you do really bad, or not too bad, but if you uh, die enough, you'll just run around naked for a while. Not not something I plan on doing anytime soon, but uh, <laughs> I think it's fun. Also, Sabrina, you mentioned how the jumping puzzle last episode, that little chest was um, a mesmer that's just helping people get to the end of a jumping puzzle, which is kind of awesome. I like stuff like that. You know, someone just, someone just helping someone out, other people out. That's what I like about Guild Wars. They seem to be pretty... Uh, you know, it's it's all about helping each other out, which is which is nice. Oh, I found a chest here. Let's open it. Oh, a harpy! I'm trying to open a chest. Go away, please. You young harpy. Well, I'm glad you feel some Melikor. Open, 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 open. Ooh, a focus I can't use. Just what I wanted. Get rid of it here. Oh, we got a harpy, harpy warrior here. Positive materials while we can. Use our luck. And there we go. Finish this run on heart. Let's get down here. I was like, let's jump. Nope. Well, we can jump a little bit. Now, where are we looking? What am I missing here? I'm missing one waypoint and that's it. One one waypoint. Uh, where is it going to be? Oh, well, let's uh, check this out first. It's pointing me to an area that I haven't found yet, so it's probably there. That would make sense. So let's see. Well, let's read this first. So greetings to you. I wanted to let you know how grateful the German Pirate 
the Tormund Pirate py- py- Pyrie and I are to your assistance in ghosts at Ghost Summit. Before you arrived and lent a welcome ham, we were having a little success with finding off the harpies who were impeding our ability to continue our research along the wall. Uh, as you might know, the Dormant Pyrie has been gathering ancient Ascalonian artifacts with the hopes that they might reveal something about the nature of the ghosts we are forced to perpetually battle. Because of your assistance in this effort, we now uh, we are now a little closer to our goal. Awesome. I'm glad I could help. Let's see if you're selling anything. Are you selling something awesome? Well, let's sell my junk first. Let's see here. A recipe for a crystal scroll. Yeah, you might as well grab that. Uh, I think that's probably an item for stuff. Toughness. No, I already have better stuff right now. Thanks again, Sabrina, for the awesome items. Let's use our thing here. Uh, that's an event item, so I'm not sure if I need that for something later on. But let's, uh, let's aim towards... Okay. It's down here. Where is it pointing me? Oh, way down here. Okay, so let's uh, let's zoom out a little bit. And... Nope, nothing's popping up. So yeah, it must be down here. So I'm going to go to this point, waypoint. Just pay the 18, the 18 uh, bronze, the 18 coins to get there. This is gold, silver, and coins, I think they call it, right? I think? No, they... Coins, coins, coins. Yeah, gold, silver, bronze coins. So let's uh, head this way. Past these guys. Past these Ash Legion. Fellow Ash Legion soldiers. Ooh, I also have some training here. Anything I can do? Oh, yeah, I'm trying to save up for this top one, so I have to train nine, so I have to save up for it. Shouldn't take too long, hopefully. Ooh, what's down here? There we go. Oh, I found the last one here. And another guild puzzle. So again, a guild officer needs to activate this mission before you can take part in this puzzle. So let's leave. I want to go in here, though. It looks like there's something cool in there. Can I look through the... There's something in there. I want to go see it. <laughs> That's cool. I like that. So let's... uh found everything. So I got a piece of mail here. Uh, so good one work on exploring all of Ashford. You nearly got your tail kicked, but we can we are confident uh, you'll go on to do better next time. You you've got the markings of a great explorer. So let's uh let's leave. Oh, got some ghosts here. Oh, we got a veteran ghost here. Should be able to take you out. And as soon as I take you guys out, I will let's see what I get in my chest here. Let's uh get those items there. My swirling hammers are my new favorite ability. Well, they have been my favorite ability for a while. Ooh, a veteran mage. Let's take you out, too. I like taking you guys out. There we go. Shield block. Haha, <laughs> I blocked your attack. Take that. I like that attack, too, because you, you hit them and you pull them back. And look, I dodged all of his magic spell. That's how you do it. Uh, so let's hit inventory here. Uh, I can't use that anyway, so let's just get rid of it. Bloop. Lots of materials. And let's see what we got here. Ooh, rich copper vein too. So I'm going to just start mining this rich, op- rich copper vein. No, no gathering tools equipped? What? Oh, no. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. It's okay. So let's, uh, let's see what we got here. So we're going to get a... Uh, Steam Dagger of Agony. Ooh, I'm going to get some uh, some shoulder pads here. I get a Black Lion chest and some jute scraps. So let's accept that, guys. Inventory for a second here. And deposit all. Uh, I'm going to just get rid of these because I don't need it. Ooh, precision condition duration. And get rid of that one, too. So let's uh, deposit all materials. Click, click. There we go. I'm going to put you down here. Oh, no. I'm going to put you down here for now. <gasps> I've got a black lion chest. I'm going to open I'm gonna open up a black lion chest with this black lion key. I don't know if it's always smart to open them up with, like, low-level characters like this. But you know what? Let's just let's just do it for the fun of it. Um, so do I open up? Do I op- double-click on the key? Oh, okay. Double-click on the key. So, actually, let's take a look at what we can get from this preview, I think. So... 
so my common items are, I think it looks like I'm getting a special kit used by the order. This, So I'm going to get one of these, it looks like, when I open it up. And I can get some Black Lion claim tickets, uh, self-styler hair kits, total makeover kits. So these are some kits. Ooh, a Hounds of Balthar mail carrier. And then we can get some finishers, which are kind of cool. Can I, can I preview them? Oh, I can even preview the ones I can get. Ooh. Oh, I like that with the... <laughs> the whole... They're doing the battle. Um, looks like some skins for some weapons. Oh, apparently I'm under attack. By a veteran Escalonian fighter. I'm going to take you down quickly. Bloop. Bloop. Put my hammer down. Do some damage there. <laughs> You guys just aren't what you used to be, are you? Let's go for. Actually, you know what? Let's um. It wants me to go here to the next area, so I'm just gonna go to this waypoint, and then I'll open my black line chest. What? All right. So let's take another look here. No gathering tools equipped up here. That's sad. Uh, so double click on this. Oh no! I want to preview. So preview. Uh, let's actually preview the... Let's preview the sword. Okay, so that's kind of a cool little look there. What is the other one? Um, the pistol. I want to look at the sword. Where's the sword? Well, maybe the axe. Let's preview the axe here. Oh, that's looking cool. I would like something like that. But there's a chance of getting that. Chance of getting all these other things, so let's uh, let's just give it a try. Every chest awards three to four items with the following of the following seasonal list. Okay, so let's double click on the key. So I'm gonna get one of these and two other items. Let's just open it. Let's do it. Let's see two. Ooh, I got three items. Awesome. So I've got uh, Merchant Express, so double click to consume. Double click to summon a Black Lion Merchant for 15 minutes, allowing you and your allies access to basic supplies and sell loot, single use. A guaranteed wardrobe unlock, double click to consume. Consuming this will unlock one random wardrobe option that you do not already have in the following categories. Equip skins, outfits, dyes, gliders, miniatures, finishers, mail carriers, cool. And a permanent lie line finisher, double click to consume. Channel the power. Cool. I actually got some decent stuff there. I like that. Uh, let's preview this one. Which one did I get? Oh, I got the one I looked at. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> so I double click that. So I'll use that. Uh, you know what? Let's let's actually use that one. Um, let's open up this. So I got uh, strength booster. So increase my strength. Increase your out outgoing damage by 5% for one hour. Okay. Fire Orchid Blossom. Double click and consume. Once it uh, can be consumed for outbound magic or traded with vendors. Let's consume that. That, uh, I believe, is this here. Earned in various ways and locations. Heavily affected or by the expensive. Uh, so I can use that to purchase things. Let's see what else we got. Unidentified dyes. Ooh. Country blue dye. Violet ice dye. And grapevine dye. So let's take those. I like dyes. Uh, you know what? Let's um Let's do it. It's easy when you know how. What unlocked did I get? Unlocked uh the Atherized Sword. Let's see what that looks like. H um let's go to equipment is that what i'm looking for outfits no uh yeah let's go equipment sword how do i change the skin of a sword do i have to go to wardrobe okay must have to go to wardrobe let's select select a sword Ooh. Oh, that actually looks really cool. That is awesome. Compared to some of the other ones I got. And again, 
Anytime I want to do this, I cost me one transmutation charge, although I do have 36. You get a ton of them by unlocking, uh, just doing your daily stuff, which is, or your uh, daily unlocks, which is awesome. But man, that sword looks really cool. I like that. I'm glad I got that. So all in all, that was a good, uh, a good little victory there, or a good little pack there. I like that. So apparently it doesn't, it does pay to actually use those. I was worried like, oh, maybe I won't get anything because I'm low level, but None, nothing you get is really level locked, so that's cool. I like that. Oh, got a forest spider here. Uh, I'm not gonna change the look of my weapon because you know I'll probably get new weapons right away, like all the time. So that's something I'll probably deal more, more after I hit level 80. I mean, I'll start switching items around. But let's head to this new area. Uh, is that where we're headed to? You know, map button. That's what I wanted to open. We are gonna head to. Uh, where are we headed to? Uh, looks like we are headed to... Sorry about that. I was checking something. Um, uh, Diasu Plateau. So it's beyond the wall. So that's where we're headed to now, guys. Let's do this. Bloop. Nice little... Uh, Artwork there. So we're in a brand new area here. Okay, so let's hit our map here for a second. So this area is 15 to 25. Uh, again, we're already level 18, so we're doing pretty good here. We got a bunch of ghosts right in front of us. Take out these Ascalonian fighters. Probably a lot of Ascalonian ghosts still here because, well, you know, they came to fight uh, the undead. Oh my gosh, this guy's kicking my butt. What level? You're level 24? Why are you such a high level? Is there a better place to come across here? Maybe I should come here first. Um, if you're going to be like level 24, I think I might do that actually. Um, let's do that. Maybe this is the safer place to go to the new area. Yes. <laughs> okay, this might be better. But I know sometimes there's multiple waves into different areas. So, ooh, now we got this little symbol of the Plains of Ashford. I'm really excited. Apparently, you could actually learn, or uh, you can go everywhere in the world and get this little symbol. So I'm pretty excited. I want to do that someday. That is my new goal in life, is to get all, all of the, the place for my characters. Let's. Uh, I believe I can head here and probably head. Yeah, looks like I can head through here. So this might be the better place. That way, I won't be like. So beat up, uh, we'll get beat up right away. <laughs> Iron March marches, marshes. Maybe not. Is this a different area too? Where are the Iron Marshes? Whoop! That is a level. Uh, that is a level fifty to sixty area. So I need to get out of here. Huh. Maybe this is the only way to go, so let's just go back. Cool. Sorry, learning. That's how we learn about things, right? I will someday go back to the uh, those marshes there, but uh, not for not for a while. I have to be level 50 for that. Uh, not quite there yet. Um, Maybe, can I get there from here? Maybe I'll do that. I'm just gonna teleport to uh, the Black Citadel here, guys. Cause I just, I don't wanna be running through uh, a really tough area and die a whole bunch. Sorry about being like indecisive here, guys, but uh, I wanna make sure that, uh, you know, you kinda start at the area we should be starting in. Bloop, jump down here. All right, all right, all right. Hit the map button here for a second. Uh, yeah, I think this will lead me in the area that I need to go. Bloomp. I wish it like told you where it was headed to here. Let's, there we go. The Diasu Plateau. There we go. This, this might be a little bit nicer area for me to be in. Because if ice, if it's pumping me out in an area that's like level 24, that would be a little tough, I think. Let's see. The town of Nolan. Cool. 
What do we got? We got some little... Oh, look at the little baby char. They're just like big char, only tinier. <laughs> That's cute. Well, let's see if this merchant has anything to sell. Need something. Let's sell junk. I don't have any junk to sell. This is a trading post. This is where I can buy and sell items on the market. Let's talk to this scout here. We have a lot of estates and farm villages located in Diasa Plateau that provide a critical service to the legions. Trouble is, we're under constant assault by separatists and ghosts. Our soldiers fight tooth and nail to keep these nuisances at bay, but it's a never-ending battle. They would appreciate any support you can give. Support them as much as I can. So there we go. These are level 15 and... Uh... 16. So there we go. We now we found the right way to go. So if you guys are ever wondering, if you feel like you're under level when you come to this new area, just uh just come to the uh come to the Black Citadel. And oh I want to fix up first. No free samples. Uh oh, problem things. I was kinda curious if I'm gonna try to climb up here a little bit. Can we see the Black Citadel behind us? Because that would be kind of awesome. No, still can't see behind that wall. But we do have a vista over here. So let's grab this Vista first. Where are we, Vista? Oh, must be... Oh, maybe we can get up here. Maybe it's the walls of the Black Citadel? I don't know. Uh, where's the Vista? Oh, the Vista's over here. Okay. I knew I saw it on the map somewhere. But, uh, whoa! This is... Don't tell her, okay? What the heck? This is like a whole... Everything's all rusted out. Everything's kind of gross looking. Is this where the char put, like, their items they don't need anymore? Try to jump up here the best I can. Whoop! There we go. So let's grab this vista. And take a look at it. Oh, that is... Yeah, like, it looks like everything's all corroded and rusted and gross. Blah! Don't like that at all. Bunch of gears... I wonder what that's all from. Oh, yeah, it looks like this is where they just dump their sewage and garbage and stuff. That's probably where that pipe comes from. Let's actually talk to this guy. Maybe he'll let us know. Maybe he'll tell us what's going on here. We got some cubs here. Hello, cubs. They're so cute and adorable. So tiny and little. Uh, oh, he's over here. Uh... Hey, let me ask you opinion on something. I've been working on an idea. Uh, see these old gears back here? I'm thinking I should do something with them, like making lamps out of them. What do you think? I could sell them and make some spending coin. Lamps, really? Yeah, sure. Some are really beautiful. Uh, I should check out the rust patterns on them. I'm a rustologist, you know. I can see the future in the flakes. Uh, I only see one flake here. See ya. <laughs> I like that. Okay. So let's head to the first little waypoint here, or the first little event here. Yeah, let's just let's just use the waypoint. How about that? Make it extra quick. There we go. Let's talk to you, uh, uh, Taiga here. So you might say this road is contested territory. Occasionally we have trouble with separatists who try to sabotage our supply routes. It's annoying at best and downright painful at worst. Is there anything I can do to help? These thieving separatists have turned the road into a minefield. Uh, if you could help take care of the rebels and disarm those mines. Also bring us any scap you find to me. Awesome. I can do that. We do that for sure. Let's actually take out a, uh, let's switch weapons here, actually. Whoa! <laughs> These are my awesome hammer abilities. Take down a forest grub. There we go. I'm taking down grubs. Grub, grub, grub. <laughs> there we go. Well, if I when you take down the grubs, their like heads explode. Oh, I got too close to you. Didn't mean to get that close to you, buddy. This should do dare. This is damage, right? It does. Okay, good. Not very much. Only like 104 damage. But hey, enough is enough damage. Ooh, here's some landmines. So let's take them out. Disarm. Uh. And then place it. Okay, cool. Apparently I <laughs> disarm it and then use it. 
Workers, Crimson Boas. Anything else around here? Nope. Whoop, we got a Separatist here. I think that's a Separatist Engineer. There we go. Silly Separatist. No match for me. <laughs> Wait, I wonder where I get next level. Oh, I get extra hero points next level. Awesome. So I'm definitely excited to level up then. Drop it. Don't need it. Uh, disarm. Drop it. Let's bring this Blood Legion soldier back up. We got a new way, a new area of interest here too. Caravan wreckage. Disarm. Drop. Oh, we got another Separatist. Take you out. Drop our Yellow Brick Road. Maybe our Hammer too. Maybe even the Rift ability. <laughs> I love that. I love that so much. So awesome. Oh. Separatist over here. Try to get a shot in. There we go. Disarm. Drop it. Don't need it. All right. Another landmine over here. And disarm. And... Oh, I don't want to put it down. I don't need... I don't want to put it down and, like, hurt other people on the road. That's not fun. Jeez. Trees have seen better days here. They're all pulled up by the roots and stuff. That's not good. All right, looking for more. Oh, we got some wolves here. Take down the wolves. Arr. Oh yeah, that's. I keep wanting to use that, thinking that's a rift ability, but it's not. It's uh, it protects us from range damage, which is good to use. Boop. There we go. <laughs> Light you guys on fire. Oh, you keep summoning allies. They kept more and more wolves come. The more the more you fight the wolves, the more co the wolves come. What is this? Oh, we can get scrap metal from the wreckage. I'm guessing. Oh, can I get can I, there? No, I have to be right in a certain spot in order to search. Okay. Uh, I don't need that metal bar. Don't need a metal bar for anything. Oh, we got a separatist here. There we go. Take you out. Shouldn't be too hard. There we go. There we go. Oh, turn that off. Forest crabs are all violent. Um, take out some more landmines, I guess. Close. I didn't want to. Didn't mean to open that. <laughs> Always opening things. I don't mean to. Let's drop it. Let's uh, disarm this and drop it. Let's revive these guys here. Ding. Revive you too. Ding, 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 ding. Thirty-one, 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 thirty-one. Oh, someone's attacking me. A separatist engineer. I feel strong. Of course you do. You're Char. Chars are always strong. There we go, guys. Drop the hammer down. More of an axe, it looks like. To be honest, it looks more like an axe, but uh, it looks good. It looks cool. Either way, I love the look of it. I kind of like the way they yell, too, when they die. <laughs> Boop. All right. Any more metal bars? Metal bars. The buddy there. Looking for some more mines or separatists. Mines or separatists. That's what I'm looking for. Well, we got a landmine here. The landmine here. Let's uh, take those down. Disarm and just drop it. And we got a landmine here. Disarm and drop it. Oh, we finished it. We finished our task. So let's see. Uh, the sounds of frequent explosions caused by the Separatists is hard on the ears. You certainly made dealing with them easier for us and given us some momentary peace. So let's accept that. And let's see if you sell anything good. Click, click, click. Ooh, chocolate bars and beets. Awesome. Deposit materials. What do you have for sale? 
Ooh, oh, I can't use shields at all. I was like, ooh, awesome, but uh, don't need the power. Let's see if those... Uh, yeah, these boots, these are more expensive down here. Well, sorry for the yawning there, guys. I'm looking for heavy armor. Yes, heavy armor. That is not as good as what I have. You are better than what I have. Let's take those. You are pretty much the same. Uh, you are better than what I have. And you are condition damage or power. Power, fury, duration. Hmm. What might might look cool? Let's give it a try. So let's uh let's see what these items are. Oh man, again someone with a wyvern. I want a wyvern so bad. These things look so cool. So let's take a look at what this new armor looks like. Ooh, ooh, starting to feel all armored up and stuff. Let's uh, take a quick look at some of the materials, or uh, some of them. Yeah, they're looking they're looking good. I like that fury duration too. Can I? Get rid of all those. Get some more luck. My luck go up. Nope. And deposit materials. Awesome, guys. So I'm feeling feeling like a real soldier here. Let's do this. Let's head north to where the next one's going to be. Let's actually dye our stuff, too. Um, I got a new purple dye. Where was it? No, it's too bright. Too bright. I don't like that bright. I need light. Lighter purple. There we go. I metal a little bit. And what am I going to do for this other one? So many awesome color choices. There we go. This one used purple as an accent. How about that? There we go. And apply. Apply. There we go. <laughs> I don't know. I like I like I like changing the color and stuff like that. Well, let's uh, see what you have to say. I've got uh, an engineer who's found a way to temporarily neutralize ghosts around here. Uh, it'll be a boost to our torch and scorch, uh, but he'll need your help. I'll do what I can. Where is he? Uh, he's in the ruins just ahead. Just look for a guy who mutters a lot. Mutters. Got it. Um, let's talk with you. Let's talk about you being in the That should do it. I'm ready to set up my machine. There's going to be exciting. Amazing. I hope I live to see it. Uh, me too. Let's go. Let's get this show on the road. All right. Let's go. So I got to protect you on the way. Hang on. This is the part where it gets ghosty. <laughs> part where it gets ghosty. I like that. Let's take these guys down. Take down all these ghosts. Silly ghosts. No. No match for me. And my hammers and stuff. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's switch weapons up again. When I get a chance. There we go. Take this guy down. Oh my gosh, he's almost. Make sure he stays alive. Ooh, leveled up. Level 19. Let's see here. We got hero points and utility slot th uh, 3 unlocked. So let's accept that. Uh, I'm going to hit H for a second. So next level, we get, uh, what is it? Rings and personal story at level two. Oh, we're going to make sure we are helping him get his stuff. I might not be able to switch weapons until after this event. Well, that's fine. Boom. <laughs> Take this guy down. Let's heal up a little bit, too. Ooh, we got a veteran here. That's why you're taking a little bit more damage. There we go. There we go. Come on, come on. There's so many of them. There's so many of them. Why are there so many of them? Don't want to disturb that. 
We are getting the event done too, which is nice. Uh, come on, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Don't fall, don't fall. We got some friends helping us now. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, heal, 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 heal. Oh, look at that save there. Let's take the items. Come on, heal up. Oh, I'm going to hit H here and go to my skills. I'm going to train the last... Oh, can I not train the last... Oh, I need to leave level 31 to train this. Oh, that's good to know. I don't want to disturb that. No, 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 no. Don't disturb that. That's going to bring out some more ghosts. We already have enough ghosts to fight. <laughs> Come on. We, we have enough ghosts. I don't need to bring more. All right. Come on. Take you down. Um, let's quickly see what qu what uh, skills we can get. One down, one to go. Um, I need to be level 21, I think, for this. Level 31 for these? Okay. Oh, I don't get specialization until 30. Okay. I really not learn that until 31. That sucks. Well, let's just... Put something here. Let's put up our third skill, I guess. So force engagement. L launch a chain at your target. Um, chain connects with the foe. It slows and taunts them. Okay, good. Let's give it a try. So you're slowed. And you have to fight me now? Is that what that is? Oh, he fell. We gotta revive him. Make sure you survive, because you need to live through this. You are my only mission, sir. Bloop. There we go. You're alive now. <laughs> you are alive. God, these, these guys, these ghosts look pretty awesome. Let's revive uh, someone here. There we go. Oh, I got some more ghosts here. I want to drop the hammer down a little bit. <laughs> well, we finished our task, which is nice. Do, do, do. <laughs> you can't run away from me, peasant. All right. Take down these guys. Drop the hammer again. <laughs> Uh, grab the loot. Take down these fighters. There we go. Oh. This is where you're building the item. Oh, you fell down. We gotta pick you back up. Make sure that you are safe because you need to... You need to get the, the, the machine up. Ghost control machine, as they call it, I guess. Let's take out this engineer. Kind of interesting how the ghosts are just—they always think that they're they're fighting Char, that they they're living, reliving the past over and over and over again. Kind of interesting. I like it. Whoop! Got a Ascalonian mage here. You guys are the worst. Light you guys on fire. All right. Well, with our buddy here, Mister Goose Almighty. You're helping out a bunch too. Oh, uh, and uh, Brodzia. Yeah, all the awesome help here. I like that. I like help. Build it faster, buddy. I mean, it's a big machine, so and I'm sure it takes takes some time to set up. So, I mean, I can't complain. He's doing it pretty quick. What is that? Ghost minions? That's cool. Let's actually do it from range now. Boom. What's next, guys? What's next? Oh, we got a bunch of items here I didn't grab. Whoop. So I got a cultist here. Slam down on you. Let's drop the hammer again. Boom. <laughs> I like when it knocks you down. It's funny. It's funny. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a big guy here. So let's uh, switch back to my close combat attacks. 
It's my hammers. Heal a little bit. Oh man, I'm gonna just get tossed around like a ragdoll here. There we go. Man, you were just you're just not All right, maybe I should just stick to ranged attacks. There we go. Oh, this won't knock me down then, right? He won't be able to knock me down if I have that ability out. Whoop, what is that? <laughs> uh, there we go. There we go, come on, come on. Protect myself from ranged attacks, there we go. <laughs> Take that, buddy. I'm trying to be smart about this, and I think it's working. Try to make my, my allies a little bit more stable, too. There we go. Whoop, I'm dying. Now I'm not. There you go, so you don't knock anyone down. Keep spamming that ability. Drop the hammer. Don't want to taunt him. Spin this up for the ghosts around me. that down again. Uh, I can drop that again. Alright, gonna heal myself up soon. There we go. Do that again. Whoop, don't want you to be close to me. He's almost down. Almost down, but so am I. <laughs> Run away. Oh, we got gold on this event. Awesome. Did I get any good items? Not really. Okay. Yes, she is. All right, guys. So. That guy was a beast. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. All right. So let's hit the map button here for a second. We got to. Head here. Alright, so let's uh, head to this waypoint. Oh, we also got this, so let's see here. Uh, greetings to you, exemplary effort, Malachor. Uh, you've got a real knack for fighting ghosts. My soldiers have started a friendly competition to try and keep up with you. Uh, but they have yet... You have set the bar pretty high, so let's accept that. And... Let's see what else we got going on. Let's light the torch, why not? Grab the waypoint, and let's see what else. Oh, let's keep going. There's a scout here. I'm gonna go talk with the scout before I do anything. There we go. Talk with you, Mr. Scouty Scout. Ooh, we got some points of interest down here too, so I gotta head down there. But that was that was good. I like that. We got a bunch of items here. Ooh, we got a salvage item. Salvage item. Deposit all materials. And some items to sell too. Let me make sure I do that. Alright, where's the scout? There's a scout in front of me. There you are. You got this wolf along the way though. I, I know you're just going to call more wolves. That's fine. Boom. There we go. Jaladis estate is well known for their unusual cattle raising methods. They race their cows competitively and supposedly feed them a bizarre diet. South of Jaladis estate, there's a small separatist hideout. They frequently send operatives to disrupt the daily life around the town of Noggling. One local got so annoyed, he moved his entire garden out of the village. All right, so let's see which one I need to go to first. So you are level 17. You are a level 17 you are level 18. Well, I'm going to head down south first. Help Ashley and take out the Separatists. Let's do that. Um, but first, before I do that, let's take a look at... I got 12 points, and I can't learn this until... Um, level... Or sorry, I can't use, learn this one until level 12, 31. So let's continue on here with the, the training of the Demon. So let's train, yes... So now I've got uh, pain absorption. 
and then let's train this one here. What else does it do? Uh, resistance to yourself and nearby allies. Absorb conditions from those allies. Gain additional resistance per condition. Oh, that's kind of nice. Uh, unyielding anguish. Legendary demon. Leap toward the target area, creating a demonic field that torments and chills foes. Excellent. There we go. So if I switch to that one. Ooh, see, I got all my abilities here. Wah. Leap toward there, creating a demonic field that torments and chills. Vanish enchantment, so I got all my abilities there. But I like this guy a little bit better. But we could learn. Hmm. Let's just learn the centaur stance for now. Well, eventually, if you eventually get everything. But I guess until level 21, is that it? So I still got a couple more levels before I can go down these lines. So let's uh, continue on, guys. Oh, there we going. We're going to head south here. Talk with uh, someone. It's probably you. Yeah, I'm guessing. You up here. Whoop. Get in range of those wolves. I didn't think I would, but I did. I'll take these guys down. Wah. Before they can call some allies. There we go. Oh, let's turn off my... Oh, it turned off automatically. We're instead of power anyways. It's the boulder. I don't need that. What do you have to say? Keep your voice down. My orders are to observe and report on the Separatist base camp over there until I receive new instructions. I can't enter their camp, but whoever can move... You, however, can move freely. Uh, do you feel like causing some destruction? Uh, what do I have to do? Destroy anything you can. Get your paws on and take out as many of those Separatist humans as you can. can. I think they've got a few of our own in there, too. Head on in and do your best for me. All right, let's do it. Let's attack from above, too. Roar! Take out some separatist, separatist scum. A new build will be available in 10 minutes. Oh, okay. Apparently they're updating in Guild Wars 2 while I'm playing, which is fine because uh, uh, got less than 10 minutes left on this uh, episode anyways. I'm just going to try to finish this before I move on. Whoop. What are you doing? Why are you, why are you attacking me? <laughs> it's not like I... I invaded your camp or something like that. That would be that'd be silly. Why would someone do that? Oh my gosh. Feels so powerful taking you guys out. <laughs> Although I am taking some damage, quite a bit of damage. So let's make sure I uh heal up a bit too. Oh, we got a veteran, that's why. Oh, heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Take the loot. I'm gonna fall down. There we go. Fight to survive. Rally. As soon as you fall, you rally. That's how I like to do it. There we go. Oh, I might fall down. Oh, that's a chain attack on them. Smash. There we go. <laughs> okay, maybe maybe jumping into the middle of all of them was not the smartest idea. But it worked, so it's okay. <laughs> right? If it works, it's okay. There we go. Deposit all this stuff. Get it. Get it all ready while I'm. Ooh, apparently I'm full up of jute scraps. While I heal up, it's a supply wagon here. Let's destroy their supply wagon. Can I light supply wagons on fire? I can't. I'm surprised by that. It is made of wood. You think it'd start on fire? Apparently not, though. Wah! Oh, I thought there was someone else helping out too. There we go. Separatist Engineer, let's take you out. Come on, Professor Mew. We got this. We got this, buddy. All right. I like how the Engineers do, like, one last, like, explosion attack when they die. Oh, I didn't pull him with me. Darn, 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 darn. And rescue Char. I don't see any Char in here. Maybe they're in a different area. There was another point of interest here. Oh, they must be up here somewhere. Stephardus Basher. Knocks down, reflects projectiles. Good thing I don't have projecti projectiles to attack you with right now. There you go. Oh, they're actually hidden behind this gate. So let's just turn on our... This again so we can bring the gate down. Oh, she knocked me down. Not good. 
And I'll knock you down. <laughs> Bash. There we go. Oh, I kind of like how it's still hanging from its hinges up on top. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, I thought maybe that was the right way to go. Apparently not. Oh, got a forest grub here too. Light you both on fire. That's how I roll. I like I like lighting things on fire. Oh, finish the heart though. So let's uh how do we how do we get here? What is this? Did I here? Do I have to come around this way maybe? Let's find out. So let's uh Grab this. So I overheard chatter from the Separatist community about a serious setback they've suffered as a result of your efforts. From the sound of things, they couldn't have done a better job myself. Ooh. Oh, no, there's like a cave here. Uh, you're always welcome in Dankirk. Awesome. Take these guys out. It's also a reset time, so that's why I had this pop up. Actually, let's see. What, what did I get today? I got Bag of Celebration Double Click. Canadian Celebration Booster. Just what I wanted. Never have too much whoop, whoop. Almost dying. Don't want to die. There we go. Uh, deposit materials. Get rid of you. Deposit materials. What is a celebration booster? What does that do? 100% uh, boost of magic find. WW, WVW rank gain. Experience from kills. And gold from kills. 10% bonus to PvP reward track bonus. Actually, that's pretty awesome. 100% boost to magic find and experience from kills. That's actually pretty good. Maybe I'll use that sometime. Let's revive this soldier here and head in here. Looks like the Flame Legion are in here. Grab this point of interest. Oh yeah, it's a whole Flame Legion cave here. Let's take these guys out. Can't have the Flame Legion in here. Gosh, there's a whole bunch of you guys in here. We got a veteran too. Let's take the veteran out. Heal up. Use my abilities here. Loot. Since no one's attacking me, I'm gonna I'm gonna stand here and heal up a little bit. Ooh. Oh. What's that? Oh, I can't use that. There we go. Let's take these guys out. What is that for? Oh, I already have the skin unlocked, so it's okay. Oh, it's a great sword. Okay, that's what it is. And I can't use great swords, guys. Not this profession. Also, I started. I started playing like just on my own for fun. I started playing an engineer. I didn't realize uh, engineers can only have um, long, like the rifles, pistols, and shields. That seems like that's the only items they can use right now. I'm interested by that. Most most carry classes can use a bunch of different items. There we go. Slow you down. Light you on fire because I like lighting things on fire. Throw my hammers down. Jump back. There we go. Took out the the veteran here. Oh, he didn't give me anything. Is there anything in here? No? No? Okay. I thought maybe there'd be like a little item or something. A little, little hidden out of the way item place. Well, I guess they, they kind of show you on the map where it is, so not that hidden. I don't have the tools. I need to get some mining tools. That's what I need to do. Next time I'm in a place, I need to get some mining tools. Should ignore these guys. Just want to get to this area here. There we go. There we go. Um, what is this? Oh, I can make a, a copper doubloon. Just a uh, boon duration. Ah, I don't need that right now. All right, all right, all right. So let's see if I can switch up weapons and stuff. The axe here. 
Yeah, I still want to keep the sword. No, let's go with the axe for now. All right, guys. But uh, I think, yeah, it's looking like I'm gonna I'm gonna end this episode here, guys. So thank you so much for watching. I'm still having so much fun with my char. Uh, please keep all the information. Uh, you guys are you guys are teaching me so much about the game. If you guys have any other uh, suggestions, ideas, please let me know. Uh, looks like we are almost level twenty. So next episode we should be starting with the uh, amazing. Uh, oh, apparently the game's going to restart in two hours. Anyways, uh, we're going to be play, uh, starting with the, our uh, new personal story, uh, which is pretty awesome. We'll, we'll get that uh, after a little bit. Almost there. So thank you guys uh, so much for watching. If you like what you see, hit that like, subscribe button. If you don't like what you see, you can hit that dislike button too. But please, before you do that, just let me know uh, down in the comments below. Or just leave me some comments. Let me know what's going on. Uh, it would help me out a whole ton, guys. So thank you so much for everything, guys. And until next time, keep your stick on the ice.